Crittenton Women's Union transforms lives by creating opportunities for low-income women to live, work, and thrive. CWU helps 420 families a year through its emergency and supportive housing programs. Families receive much more than a place to live. They receive the support necessary to begin to create economically stable lives. Meet Lichelle. She and her baby girl arrived at CWU's emergency shelter last year. I was like kind of bummed, like, oh my God, like, I've never been to the shelter, my family never been to the shelter, it was something totally different. Lichelle's case manager recommended she apply to Abbott House, CWU's two-year supportive housing program for young mothers. Most Abbott House moms are on their own for the first time. Each has her own apartment and creates a self-sufficiency plan. They learn about budgeting, education and career planning, and other essential life skills. There's been like, a lot of workshops here lately. One recently we just had for um, interim skills, so how to get the job and what are the no's to the question, what are the yeah to the questions. Um, we have meetings held every other week on a Wednesday from 6 until 7.30. Lichelle just got a new job and contributes to the rent on her Abbott House apartment. In the spring, she will start a medical information management program at Bunker Hill Community College. Most other people don't get this type of help like we have here at Abbott. So actually, it's kind of life, it's a life changing experience. Like, at first, if I was still working, I would have thought about going back to school, honestly. I would have just kept working and working and working. But going back to school, Coming here, it's different. Like I've seen a lot of different changes in my life now. Meet Maria. Maria is the single mother of a five-year-old daughter and a lawyer in her native Ukraine. When she came to CWU, she was unemployed and unable to find a job. I moved from Florida to Boston and thanks God I had some family here, so I stayed with them. Um, but I was looking for a job. Maria signed up for CWU's Woman to Woman program, our 12-week career development course. Woman to Woman puts students on a career path or on a course to higher education. They receive training in Microsoft Office Suite, attend work and life skills workshops, and meet with academic and career counselors. Well, I think this was a really, really good experience because I thought that I just needed, you know, improve my computer and English skill, but it turns out that it was a really, really good environment. People who work here really care. They really um, wanted to help you. And here they actually ask us to think about what we're going to do mm -hmm. after this program, and they ask us to think short-term goals, long-term goals. So um, I decided that the best for me is going to be to find a job. Within a month of graduation, Maria got a good paying job in a law firm. It's, it's helps me a lot to accomplish that goal. So again, that's um, opening a new door for me and I just got promoted, you know, making more money, you know, can support my daughter and myself without any assistance. So that, that's a good feeling, so. CWU understands that becoming economically independent is not simple and does not happen overnight. To offer families clear paths out of poverty, CWU has developed a pioneering comprehensive approach, working with families long term until they attain their goals. Meet Yolanda. Yolanda was a single mom of two children living in public housing who knew she needed help. I wasn't sure what kind of help, but I knew I needed help. I have something that I want to do, but I don't know where to go. I don't know where to start. But I need somebody like to tell me, you know, you should start over here. And then you can get, you know, where you want to go. 
Yolanda applied to Career Family Opportunity, CWU's five-year program that helps single parents establish a firm foundation for an economically secure life. A CFO participant works closely with a mobility mentor to set personal goals. For each goal she reaches, she earns financial incentives. They motivate me to do things for myself because every time I accomplish um, something, then I get incentive mm -hmm. for it. When I tell my family this, like, uh, you, I don't believe that, so I, I can show it. Because I say, you know, it's make me, it's for me, and then, and then when I do it, and then somebody's like, give me incentive for that because I'm doing something, it's like, push me to do things more of, uh, even I want to leave it for next year, I want to do it now. Each CFO is working towards two five-year goals, a job that pays enough to support her family and $10,000 in savings. Yolanda had a personal goal of buying a house. After just two years, she achieved her dream, owning her own home. It's an amazing thing that happened in my life. I mean, everything that I accomplished now, um, I'm thankful to CW because they they involved in everything I, I've been doing. You can help women like Lichelle, Maria, and Yolanda by making a donation, volunteering your time, or becoming a grassroots advocate. You can learn more at LiveWorkThrive.org.